Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. I am 64 Super Mario player. I'm I'm gonna get back to recording Ocarina of Time. Oh yes, that's right. It's time for episode five, part three of Ocarina of Time. Holy shit! By the way, finally got Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask on the Wii U Virtual Console. So yeah. So let's finally get back to the game that I wanted to get back to. And now, let's go. Yes, I'm using my headset this time, so no audio. So my commentary volume will not be lowered to any kind of low decibels. And if you do hear that in the background, that is my, uh, that is the heating duct. And now we're finally back with the, oh shit. Yeah, this could get a bit loud at some points. So I'm going to actually turn the game volume down. Do something I should have done in my uh, uh, previous uh, my previous attempt at doing this episode. So let's see, get that up to 50. Fifty one. Eh, that works. Anyway, this is the last part for Dodongo's Cavern. And ooh, ooh, that was close. And now I'm gonna do that. Climb up. Now I gotta do this. My rupee count does look a bit different now, guys, because I uh went out and grinded a bit. As uh, I was getting everything caught up and up, <laughs> Max Ruby count up the green. There's the green. Ah, all right, let's get that. We're up there. Oh, first try. Sweet. Now I don't have to waste time. And now here we are. We're finally getting through this together. Now, guys. I will be recording episode 6 tonight as well, getting that uploaded and all that shit. So, yeah, I'm trying to get my regular projects done right now. And, uh oh, baby Dodongos, better dodge. By the way, there's a cute little animation that they do, which is so fucking cute. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, got to stay on this little piece of land. Wait until the other one comes over here. Now, yeah, this area is a bit. Yeah, try to do something, bitch. What the? Maybe I should just go into the center. Whew. Yeah, come on, bitch. I ha I don't have all day. And you're dead. Okay, cool. But I did that without taking any damage. My failed recording, I took a lot of damage, so... Oh, yeah, don't fall through here. You know why? Because then you have to go all the way back around. And now, here we are with this second flame pillar kind of puzzle. This one you gotta shoot over the fire to this eye to disable the one in front of you. And you're probably wondering, where's the second eye? Look right here. Look no further than this one. And gotta hurry like a bat out of hell. And we're good. And now, here we are. We're about to obtain our dungeon item. And yeah, it is quite explosive, so be careful with these ones. Handle with care now, as I like to call it. I also am happy to say that this is now back up and running. After I get this episode up, there you go. Eight videos in. That's good. After I get like two, three, two or three more videos up, I am going to take a break from this and actually uh, and take a break from this and uh, 
and go to Majora's Mask, which just got released onto the Wii U Virtual Console, thank God. And I will be uploading episode one of that probably soon, but I'm actually going to be taking my time with that because, well, I can't take my time because there's a time limit, so shit. Uh, anyway, let's get our bombs out. Our newly equipped, our newly obtained bombs. Yes, I do have two bottles of milk this time. Yep, I'm getting my last ready for the boss. And please count, please count. It count. It counted. And now... And that one is a good. And now, we're making the Dodongo see red. And now, we're finally getting back into the action of this game. And make sure you uh, land right here. And then land there. So you don't take damage. And there you go. Two auto jumps is, are good for this. And yeah, I'm not wasting any more time. Let's just get right straight to it. Oh, shit. Forgot about this. Okay, let's get you guys. Let's lure you. Yes! Yeah, you can actually stun these guys with the, uh... You can stun these guys with the, uh... With the, uh, Deku Nuts. So, yeah, that's a very cool way of doing things. But it does stun them. And yeah, whenever they're stunned, they have this little animation that they are that they're in that they're trying to break out of being stunned. I'm not gonna deal with these ones because it's just uh they're just too much of a hassle. Fuck you. Anyway, I got my ass whooped when I was trying to get this game caught up. I accidentally loaded the save state that was in my practice file. One of my practice files. One of two of them. I'm going to collect that fairy so I can be back at full health. And now, as you can see, ooh, this looks familiar. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right. Yeah, here we are. We're just pushing blocks. Yeah, bitch. <laughs> I love doing that. Yeah, you can actually stun uh, the keys with the Deku Nuts, which is a very good way of taking care of those bastards. Especially with the fire keys when they could... Potentially burn your shield. The Deku shield, to be exact. But, with this said... Well, looky here. We're at the boss. Let's see the time. 8 minutes and 25 seconds. But before we blow up that floor... That odd-looking that odd -looking piece of floor there... We're going to get more bombs in our bag. So, yeah. And we're going to stand right here, safely. Okay, I forgot to duck. And, oh shit! And here we are! Now guys, you better pay attention to the strategy that I have to tell you guys. There is a little strategy I like to call the bait and switch. So, the bait part is that you give him a bomb. And, holy shit, this looks terrifying. And now... Yes, we use the dungeon item. And now, chase him. And the switch part is that you get him to turn around. And... Chase after him again. Just like so. Get him to turn around. And now, this should be it. And he's dead. That was quick and easy. 
I, I always like doing that strategy because I don't want to waste any time with this boss fight. Besides, now it's finally... It's finally time for me to actually get this out to you guys. I am going to wait for a little while, little while to uh, start up my uh, LP for... To start things up with my Wind Waker LP. Just because I don't want to waste any time with uh, getting that stuff done and Jesus that is morbid anyway with that done that uh, didn't mean to set, hit that shit yeah let no actually no 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 okay now let's go and get our meda or medallion up oh, spoiler alert Dorinia also gives you a uh, medallion hold on a second Oh shit, ow! God damn! Well, thanks, Darunia, but you gotta hit my head very hard there, buddy! Ow! So... Yeah, so guys, it feels good getting back to this game. With this game actually being done right now, I have no problem saying this. I actually am not getting content ADs on my N64 videos. But I am getting content IDs on my Wii U stuff. And Nintendo. Anyone who works for Nintendo, anything that you write, any song that you write, it belongs to the company, not necessarily you. All right? Mm, yeah, finally, we're getting the Goron's Ruby. And yeah, and yeah. Give me the spiritual stone. Only then I will I open the cave for you. Eh, don't, don't be trusting Ganondorf, Darunia. <laughs> Kid, I like you. How's about you and I become sworn brothers? No, there's no big ceremony involved. Just take this as a token of our friendship. Okay, we're friends with Gorons, and yeah, Link was laying down that whole time. Ugh, thank Christ! Back into uploading these videos. Ugh, man, it feels good. And now, guys, I get to officially show this off. I now have the Gorons Ruby. We got the Kokiri's Emerald and then the, the Goron's Ruby. So you know what that means, right? Episode 6 will be a a trip up to Death Mountain. And brother, you'll keep brushing up on your skills as you as you travel, won't you? You you should go to you should go see the great fairy up on Death on, on top of Death Mountain. She will power you up. Hey everybody! Let's see off our, let's see off our brother. Uh-oh. You did great! How about a big Goron hug, brother? Oh shit! Get away, get away, get away, get away, get away! Anyway, guys. Thank you for watching. I am 64 Super Mario player, and um, I gotta say, it feels great to be back. By the way, I'll give I'll be gonna be uploading uh, Mario 64 episode two tomorrow after I get off work. Anyway, I'm gonna record that get after I get off work. All right, so God damn it, feels good to be back. Love you guys. See you then.